In this video, I'm going to be explaining how to make mockups and tech packs. I don't know why, but a lot of people overcomplicate mockups and tech packs. In my personal opinion, it's pretty simple, and I'm going to be explaining how to make every single part. The first thing that you can do is buy a mockup pack. You can buy these packs from Etsy, Fiverr, or Instagram. A lot of people use the Seags mockup pack. I've never used it. The price is pretty good though, and I heard it's pretty good. So you could buy it from there. It doesn't really matter. Personally for me, I don't use vector packs, and I never paid for one. And I'm going to be explaining how to actually make a mock-up without paying anything. And in my opinion, you shouldn't really pay for it unless you want that professional look, but it's not necessary. The first thing you want to do is find a blank vendor website, for example, Made Blanks, Root Porter, etc, etc. It doesn't really matter. And then you want to take the product pictures from their website and use that as a mock-up picture. However, there's a lot of times where they don't have your color or a color that you want specifically. What you want to do is you want to outline the shirt and get rid of the background and add your color onto the shirt and add a design and that's a mock-up. There you go, that's easy. I'm now going to talk about a tech pack. A tech pack is also pretty simple. All you're doing is outlining all the traits that you want on your shirt. For example, for my brand, I want a puff print for the name and I want screen print for the design and you just outline it. And if it's cut and sewn, you want to put each measurement of the shirt. I just put two for now for an example, but you pretty much get the point. And for the color of the shirt, if it's like a pretty unique color, you want to put the exact color name of the shirt, as well as you want to put the weight of the shirt. For example, I put 200 GSM, as well as the sample size, assuming that you are ordering samples first, which I recommend you do before you do the bulk order. And then after that, you want to send the tech pack to your manufacturer. And usually nine times out of 10, they can probably make it. If there is a complication, they'll usually tell you. They don't just do it by themselves. To give another example, these are one of the sweatpant mock-up designs I did not use. And as you can see, I make it very clear what I want as far as color, puff print, screen print, whatever it is. And it's pretty simple. It's not that hard. It's not some difficult thing that you have to pay somebody to make. And I wouldn't really complicate it too much. And that's pretty much it. It's that easy. It's pretty simple. If you want to look at my Instagram or my website, it will be in the description. And that is the end of the video. Thank you for watching.